Park, who is doing his part to help refugees find safe passage. Thank you uh, for joining us this morning. Brooks, what, could you just tell us the situation where you are? Yeah, hi. I'm, um, I'm actually in Fromborg, which is uh, a refugee centre uh, run by the Catholic community here. And they've uh, taken in a, uh, three families, really, from the, close to the Belarus border, who um, actually look after oh, children with awesome. special needs. And um, so broadly at the moment, at the moment I'm, I'm, I'm visiting various refugee centers, but my main objective uh, for the past three weeks has been trying to get uh, Ukrainian women and children out of uh, Ukraine uh, and into the safety of Poland. And that's been my primary objective. Over the past three weeks, I've managed to move 6,383 uh, women and children from Ukraine into Poland. What are some of the human stories that you've heard so far, then? Um, look, I think, uh, so, for example, this morning, the families that I met uh, here in Fromborg, um, and it's run by uh, 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 the priests here, you know, they, they were saying to me that the children in particular were extremely traumatized. And when the, the symptom of trauma is they were very silent, incommunicative, and so on. It's now been a good two weeks since they've been here. Uh, they've opened up. And, um, but the trauma in particular, it's not, you know, it is particularly the children that I'm most concerned with. And uh, the children have been very, very traumatized by their experience. I can imagine it just seemed like an unrelenting story of absolute horror, destruction, rape, massacre, murder, explosions. I mean, yeah, I, I've got an, yeah. I've, I've actually got an interesting story for you. So okay. there was, you know, with one of the, the uh, women that I met who'd actually come up from Mariupol. When the Russians came into her house, they were shouting, where are the Nazis? Where are the Nazis? And she's saying, there are no Nazis here. Like, what are you talking about? She says, no, no, no. Where are the Nazis? And they went through the whole house breaking down doors, looking under beds, looking for these sort of invisible Nazis that uh, Putin have been talking about. It's, it's, it's ridiculous, this war.